Hello and welcome back to Workshop Wednesday and today I got another 5 creations to show you actually before I go and show them in details let me just go in the workshop and I will show who made who before I even go to them so the first one will be this GMC truck which looks pretty pretty decent and looks quite big and I hope it also works well so it's made by Nathan. 7472 looks like he's Spanish or something in some weird language. So, the next one will be this modern home by Ice Tarko. Then there will be this, uh, let's see what is the name of it, Tone Quad, Tone Quad ATV. It's made by Lord Paint, and actually, I picked this one because I'll actually show you a little bit later why I picked this one. Then there will be this Baja Monster B made by a uh, real. Frankie boy looks pretty pretty decent and then there will be also this retro specs uh, walking wind up uh, toys here are many of them you can check his workshop and his YouTube channel there's many versions of this one and yeah maybe I'll show this and this is the platform but yeah so these will be the ones I will show and actually today I'm joined by Enbond he's the same guy who helps me build some of my creations so he just joined and will enjoy these creations as well so let me start with the first one which will be this huge GMC track and actually it looks pretty decent from the outside and this door oh <laughs> this is the door it's so tiny I guess just to not ruin the design so yeah it looks like there's only two buttons is for the door and for the headlights or maybe each seat have its own dedicated button and looks like you can't really open passenger seat passenger doors which I don't really think is a, is a bad thing so let me close it something did I open something oh the doors get stuck it let me try maybe he can jump in oh where are you oh you are in all right let me zoom out let me try around with this one Actually, let me just try it this way, because like in all previous episodes I always go forward, so this time let's just go back, because... Actually, each, in each episode I'm saying I'll go back, but I always go back to that route, because that's the only road around. And actually, it goes and rides pretty well. Let's see how capable it is when you try to drive somewhere uphill. Let's try to drive up here and see how it goes. Lag. You're lagging, not me. <laughs> yeah, it looks and drives pretty good actually. And the suspension. I really like the suspension. I'm always surprised then. I really like when people make really good suspensions. So let's just drive and try this hole here. Oh yeah, it looks so good on drives. And I really like these black thingies, black screws on the wheels. So it covers wait the wheel isn't it white oh wait there's two wheels inside yeah I thought from the inside looks white and from the outside is black so yeah somehow he made the glitch welding and made two wheels inside each other same go oh yeah the lights is as well glitched in that's pretty neat I still haven't figured out how to do glitch like that but yeah it makes more more compact and more good looking vehicles I like the design yeah it's pretty awesome design and there's even exhaust or or oh I thought the exhaust is part of suspension but exhaust is just separated which looks oh and the whole whole exhaust system is finished let's see where the exhaust system goes in or it just goes inside the engine yeah, the steering happens in the center, just like, just like real cars and where. Oh, I'm back here. All right, let's go. The next creation. Let's drive over here. Cause I really like to drive with this one. All right. The next one is this ATV, ATV, made by Lord Paint. And the reason why I picked this one is because this ATV, at wait, kill a car ATV. What? Wait, TV. Yeah, it's ATV. I just keep missing the words. Uh, I picked this one because it was in the scrap mechanic uh, 
picture when they released these lights. This car, no, but this vehicle actually was in the screen, so I thought it's pretty amazing that some some of the viewer creations actually got viewer creations, no, just the player creations actually got in the screenshot of Scrap Mechanic devs. So let me get in the seat and drive around a bit. It's really basic and generic, but it looks so freaking amazing. So the one, oh, the one lowers the back. I guess you can fit two of these ones inside each other. And, oh, these are the hazard lights and the headlights. Actually, let me try something. Let me get in. Lower this one. Uh, let me spawn another one. And we'll see if I able... Let's see, scroll down. If I able to get to quad ATV. What do you call RTV? Not really sure. ATV. Alright, let's drive in and we'll see if it actually fits. Oh, and the lag is real. The lag is real, but it does fit. It does fit. Alright. And now let's close the back and see if it will able to hold two trailers, so one number one was to close it, alright, it's in, it's in, and now I have two tra trailers, <laughs> one is full of other ATV, oh, and it's going out, come on in Bond, don't, don't lag me out, <laughs> this is actually really funny, I wonder if I'm able to make you longer, in longer chain, let me try to spawn another one, I know the lag will be really, really bad, but I really have to try this one, Cause this is really funny. Come on, drive in. Oh yeah, I feel the lag. I feel the lag. Come on, drive in. The lag won't be, won't be, won't be for long. Let's just hope if it works for a second. And if it does, I'll just. I'm not really sure. I'll just stop driving if it do does work. Oh yeah, it works. It'll be so funny. In the lags wasn't. Yeah, looks like it actually works. Alright, and next in the row is this B. Let me actually see what was the name of this creation so I don't call it wrong. So it's. A, oh, there is no. Oh, there is no name. Badger Monster B. It looks very similar to my, my truck. I'm not really sure what was the name of mine. Of this one. See, they. Some kind of shapes are the same. So it looks silly, really amazing. By a real Frankie boy. So let's try this one. Actually, let's see where is the driver seat. No, maybe the back opens. Oh yeah, the back opens. Let's close it from here. Let's run in. All right. So looks like there's only one seat and there's many buttons. So let's see what they are actually doing. Wait, did the radio turn it out automatically? Let's see. Or maybe inbound turned on. Not really sure. Oh yeah, looks like the radio turns on automatically. Wait, you... Let's see, now... Much... See, the radio is in the hotbar. Yeah, let's... Let's end on the wheel. Add... Add the seat, why the wheel? Yeah, looks like you can't turn off the radio. So let me zoom out. So, number... Oh, this... This is cool, this is cool. Let me close it back. Check out the exhaust at the top. I hope it's exhaust and not some other stuff which I misnamed or miscalled in some other words. <laughs> that happens often. So what was the number? Oh, it's back lights. Don't get it. Oh, the front and rear lights are on different switches. So number looks like something from film about zombies apocalypse. Yeah, it's just in too bright colors for apocalypse because apocalypse should be really darker, I guess. Let's see. This horn, but what does this do? Not really sure, nothing really happening. I bet they're happening something. But more fabric. Yeah, more. It's made like uh, in some fabric. Not, not human made. Is that what he means? So let's see. More urban, yeah. Let's see which. Oh, this was the back. Looks like, yeah, but why they added this? Oh, wait! You can open the front? Don't have the button to open the front. Or maybe that was this button which didn't do anything. Oh, wait! Oh, yeah, this looks like it was just stuck in. And now it came loose. But where's the button from the outside? Because it looks like you can't get inside from the outside. But yeah, now it really works. 
Looks like there was something stuck in. Yeah, there's headlights, daylights. Yeah, this is also really, really cool. And actually, it looks like it's fun to drive with this on. Oh, and the suspension that switch each wheel. Let's try to see if it's able to drive. Let's not crush it. If it's able to drive over this here, these these rocks here. Let's pick up the small. Oh, the front's really low, but other than that, it should actually drive over and drive. Anyways, check it out. I really didn't expect it will drive over it. Let's see if there's some other small rocks. Let's try to climb over this one. Yeah, I guess that there's so many wheels that the front just lifts off. Maybe I should go from the other side. Looks a little bit low. Let's go out and all right. Let's go from the other. S oh, we can easily drive over this one. This is really cable car, actually. Let's try to drive over from this side. We'll see how it goes. It should should drive over, right? See, check it out how easy it gets over the rocks. This is pretty cool. Actually, let's try to drive up here in the cliff and the mountain, or whatever how you call this one. We don't really care, and let's go uphill here and see how this performs here. Check out how cable this. I guess it's a late wheel drives. It's 8x8. Eight eight. Not really sure how to call when our wheels are driving on more than four <laughs> four wheels, if that makes sense. Alright, let me drive down here. What the hell was that? Let me drive down here. And uh, let's go to this retrospect creation. It's just this wind up toy, and then I'll just go to this modern house. So, yeah, this was the B. Trans Monster B? Yeah, I guess it was Monster B by Real Frankie Boy. So, yeah, you can check his workshop creation as well. Not really sure if he has a YouTube channel as well. So, yeah, this was the Monster B. And let's go to the next one. And this actually are really cool. Alright, so uh, let's see how it works. So, I know that you can wind up here. I guess you can turn on the Civilization from the outside, you have to hold until start drive. Yeah, you can open the back and then you get in. I guess number three was the civilization. Yeah, but then it doesn't walk so fast. Let me close the back and you can just easily turn around with the A and D buttons. We have many, many different creations with this one, with this uh, mechanism, mechanism at the back, at the bottom. Yeah, they are pretty cool until they stop. Can I just hold it? Let's see, and if I release it, it should start to walk. Let's see. Oh, you have to hold until it starts to walk, I guess. <laughs> and then Bond just flip it over. Yeah, it would be cool if you could just press W and it would act like a wind up thingy as well. <laughs> what the hell? And Bond is break dancing. Yeah, this is really small. Creations I just thought to share because I thought it looks really funny and the mechanism under here is really really cool and so on. Just like all of his creations, it can dance. Yeah, <laughs> they are dancing toys.